Okay. Hello, Liara. Hello, Shepard. Okay, that's all that's going to be said there. First place to go for the Batarian codes is here. I'll go over there to go to the console. I'm sure you can do it through the glass, but. Knowles, this yeah. is Shepard. I found one of the code locations. Okay, I'll shut it down. Just need to authorize your Spectre status. Someone used this to cut off power to a dozen life support machines in the hospital. Okay, that access code is officially disabled. Can you find any more? Yep. So if you can't find it, just go onto your map and then you can find it this way. Now arriving at docking bay D24. I've got your briefing, Private. What fill you in before the squad arrives? Knowles, I found another spot where the Batarian codes were used. Holy crap. These are the remote navigation codes. Last week's crash at the docks, we thought it was an accident. Any questions? Shepard. There were 117 Alliance soldiers on that ship. All human. Just like the patients at the hospital. So we've got Batarian codes and someone with a grudge against humans. Looks like... okay. This code's offline now as well. Should just be one left, Commander. Now it's the need to understand what these refugees have been through. Wait, aren't you Commander Shepard? Solik Vaz, document... I am. Please, maybe you can help. I'm trying to document the stories of the refugees coming to the Citadel. Their loss, their sacrifices, their moments of bravery. Yes, that's just what this documentary needs. Be sure to talk to that guy, like I just did. Okay. Can I talk to him? Only if it's important, Commander. He's hurt bad. Take down the sedative a bit, but hurry. I peg his survival at 50-50. Alright. Are you Gorak? <sighs> Go away. Nothing to say. Not even what a terrorist's doing on the Citadel? Mm-hmm. You! Me! Do I know you? <laughs> <laughs> Every Batarian with someone on Eratok remembers your face. Planet that got caught in the Alpha Relay explosion. You butcher a colony. Only regret. <laughs> Don't have the strength to. I destroyed Eratot's relay to stop the Reapers from pouring through. <laughs> Easy for you to claim now that they're here. Don't pretend you have any remorse. You think I didn't feel guilty? I destroyed a colony. I've thought about the people who died, about how I couldn't warn them in time. In the end, I didn't have a choice. But I'm sorry, if that means anything. <laughs> if you're so remorseful... <laughs> if you have any real guilt... Show some mercy. <laughs> Unplug this machine. Let me join my family. Apparently shutting down his machine is the good choice. I don't know why. Oh. <laughs> but it is a choice that apparently is made and there is no repercussions for me doing it. I don't know why that took me so long to say that word. I hope so. I need support. Someone sabotaged the metagel dispensers, and I've got some idiot preaching about Cerberus down here. Knowles, this is where the last access code was used. Yep. One sec, Commander. I'm losing your signal. Shepard. Balak. You should have killed me on that asteroid over Terra Nova. I've been waiting for this. Everything that has happened to my people is your fault. All I did was stop you at Terra Nova. Yes, after you ruined my plans. My government accelerated research efforts on the Leviathan of Dis. Have you heard of it, Commander? The ancient organic dreadnought my people recovered from Jartar 20 years ago? Sound familiar? A Reaper. Your people were studying a Reaper corpse. Yes, looking for a way to reclaim our place as the true power of the galaxy. Hundreds of our best scientists were enlisted. And then they became indoctrinated. When the Reapers reached Karshan, our own people betrayed us. Defense grids were deactivated. Ships fired on allied targets. 
We were destroyed from within because of you. Don't really know how that's I didn't my fault. Your people, Balak. The Reapers did that. We were a proud race, a beautiful race. Have you seen what the Reapers have done to us? I'm trapped on this citadel. Our warships only know the locations of Reaper forces because I've tapped Council transmissions. I am the highest ranking military officer left in the hegemony, and I can't save my people. But I can end you. That makes total sense. Balak, not you sent that asteroid toward Terra Nova to help your people, but what does killing me accomplish? Vengeance. The Bahawk system. They would have died anyway when the Reapers showed up. You know that. I am uniting the Krogan and the Turians. We're the best hope for this galaxy. If you care about your people... Ah! ah. Our ships are yours. Oh, Shut hi. Up. Are you alright? Fine. You won't have any more trouble with those codes. Is that... Do you want me to arrest him? I want you to put a bullet in his head. We're all making some sacrifices today. Let him go. Spectre authority. Understood, Commander. And thanks. You're welcome. Cerberus there you are. wants our help. And if Cerberus is good enough for Commander Shepard, it should be good enough for us. Oh, for the love of <laughs> Commander Shepard, it's me, Conrad Werner. Wow, it's great to see you again. I joined Cerberus too. Conrad, Cerberus just tried to kill the Council. I'm not working with them. Oh, no. <laughs> I screwed up again, didn't I? Just, I'm sorry if I ever accused you of pointing a gun at me when you didn't actually do that. I was really stressed out. Oh, goodies. What can you tell me about your Cerberus contacts? Not much. They wanted me to help recruit people near the medical station. Which was sabotaged while you had everyone distracted. Oh. Oh, wait. Wait, wait. What happened to your no. hand there? I'll deal with it. Just don't do anything. Okay. But I might be able to help you with... Uh, whatever you're doing now that isn't Cerberus. Why are you I'm building whispering? an ancient Prothean dark energy device to stop the Reapers. Can you help with that? Well, I did write my doctoral dissertation on xenotechnology and dark energy integration. Really? Yes. In fact, I may be able to find some ancient tech schematics that could help you with construction. Hang on. I have an old contact. Ah, oh, come on, Hossel. Help me out. Sorry. The war has him scared. Hossel? Gavin Hossel, the tech researcher? I did him a favor once. Tell him this is for me. I had no idea you two knew each other. Small universe. Uh, okay, yeah, sure. Schematics over. Uh, I don't know how those work. Oh, no. It's like, in an you ancient Asari head or dialect. We need a lot of ancient Asari writing to translate. Oh, I have that. With this collection of Asari matriarch Thanks to... Uh, the yes. first game. Yes, it would. Okay, it's auto translate. One moment. Let's see. Oh no, the technology falls under an existing patent. I can't actually access the schematics without okay. a license from. Sorry. Let's see. Elcos Combine. I got that How too. How did you even? Well, this is great. I got a lot of stuff. Okay. Here you go. This is why you explore build and do as much device. as you can. <laughs> anyway, Sorry. good luck fixing the metagel dispensers. I'll just be here. Not touching anything. Good. Do not touch anything. Up, up, up! I got stuck on a box. About time. Listen, please. We just need more food. I can give you the location of some ruins. There we go. You thought I was in love. This is. 
All right, let's Updates talk to the sabotage. doctor. The Metagel dispenser should be working now. Thank you. I'll get patients moving through triage immediately. Up, uh, there he is. Conrad Werner. Great work, Shepard. And listen, I'm sorry for... Hey, that's him. That's my Cerberus contact. Hey, hey, you. You're under arrest. Uh, Werner. Ouch. Shepard. Shepard. Did I help? Yeah, Conrad. You helped. I don't even feel anything. Yep. Actually, I sabotaged his gun. It might have looked like it fired, Hi, but that was just the thermal clip overheating. Hi, Commander. It's me, Once again? Jenna. You helped me a few years ago when I was working undercover at Cora's den. First game. And now you're volunteering here. Right. Chalik showed me a few little tricks when he had me working undercover. Guess that paid off, huh? You... You saved my life. I can't uh -huh. believe you were willing to lay down your life for Commander Shepard. Oh, good They're gracious. So brave. Oh, the Commander and I go way back. Let me give you a hand, and I can tell you about it. Yeah, that's how I feel. That's how I feel. It's very awkward watching them flirt. Okay. There's still some more things to see. I need to talk to this guy. I have your footage. Thank you, Commander. I'll start editing it right away. It is always good to explore the environment as much as you can because um, you want to get as much information as you can out of people and side quests, obviously. I'll talk to you in a moment. Look at talk this. to you. All it took was a Cerberus attack on the Citadel to get folks around here to pay attention to the war. How's this any different from normal? Can't you see the desperation? This isn't happy dancing. This is forget my problems dancing. Look at the arms. If a guy waves his Look arms at the like arms. that, he's worrying about a lot more than looking stupid on the dance floor. That's, That's fair. That's surprisingly observant. I've had time to watch a lot of dancing from the sidelines. Speaking of which... Dancing? Watch <laughs> from the sidelines. What do you think about me and Edie? Sure, why not? Why not? Because I could break a bone just from some light over the clothes action? That's mm. always a risk. But then so are the Reapers. Yeah, I wasn't planning on dating Harbinger. You know what I mean. If we all ended up dead this time tomorrow, what would you regret? Getting a shattered pelvis and a broken heart. Such a stupid idea. If you could be, stupid. be out there right now on the dance floor, would you be waving your arms? Being stupid is good. Yeah. Sounds like you got bigger things to worry about than looking stupid. Yeah, guess I do. Mm hmm Now, if you'll excuse me. Hello, Jack. Ugh, this sucks. What have you got there? Duty roster for the students. It's what I do for fun now. They've got us spread out across Alliance units. Reinforcing barriers, modding ammo, that kind of thing. How are they holding up? They're fine. They're not the ones reading duty rosters while on shore <laughs> leave. Fair. Complain if you like, but I think military life suits you. Hey, running back to the Alliance was your lifelong dream, not mine. Come on, plenty of combat, free room and board, and people you can depend on. Yeah, yeah, maybe your little suicide squad taught me something about teamwork. Speaking of which, thanks. My guys are handling the support stuff well. Still see some action, but they're not on the front lines. They've saved a lot of lives. By the way, if you hear something in the background, once again, it's my AC, and I apologize. It's so hot, I need to have it on. without me. I gotta stick with them. Because I'm dependable now, apparently. I blame you for this, Shepard. Very much to be blamed.
Come on. What? The duty rosters can wait. Right now, you're on shore leave. Look at Joker over there. He's having a ball. Shepherd, everybody knows you can't dance. I can dance. See? This is how I actually dance in real life. Not mine. I miss afterlife. Yeah, this place is so clean and sweet. There's Cortez. Shepard, you made it. Come have a drink with me. You're looking happy. You had it right. Yesterday can't change. Tomorrow, we might all be dead. Today is what matters. I'm not wasting it. I wouldn't have thought a club would be to your tastes. You don't have to get all hot and bothered to appreciate graceful dancing. There's an energy here. There's life. And purgatory serves the best drinks. Here. Thank to you. To you, Steve. And to you, Shepard. A good friend when I needed one most. Thank you. For everything. You're welcome. Okay. Oh, where's Edie? Can I talk to her? No. Oh, hello, Ashley. Shepherd. I forgot you were going to be here. I don't know what to say. I'm trying to go over everything in my head. Make sense of it. I never wanted to put you in that situation. We're on the same side. Well, that'll be the first and last time I wave a gun at my commanding officer. We stopped Udina and got to walk away. That's the important part. I can't believe he was responsible for all of it. Was he indoctrinated? It's hard to say. How do we fight something that can worm its way into your head? I don't know. But that is a choice. very good question. I wanted to talk to you about that. Hackett asked me to join his team. It's a great offer, but... I'd prefer to ride this thing out aboard the Normandy. Permission granted, Lieutenant. Just keep your gun pointed at the Reapers, okay? I'd prefer it, thanks. Grab your gear and find a bunk, Williams. Aye, aye, Captain. And Ash. Yeah? It's good to have you back. Yes, ma'am. Welcome back. With the team. Shepard, I got Anderson patched in. I was just getting him up to speed. Odina? That SOB was always power hungry. But this? He wasn't in charge. Cerberus was just using him to take control of the Citadel. What the hell? Yeah. For? I don't know. Not yet. Could have been a lot worse. Shepard stopped the assassination attempt on Counselor Valorn. Kyline. What? Your assassin. What? I'll have Hackett send you my reports on him. I take it you two have met. Kaylee Sanders and I had our share of run-ins with him. I shot him in both legs once. Thought that might be the end of him. But he showed up again on Omega, even stronger. Elusive man patch him up? That'd be my guess. Given what they were able to do with you and Grayson. It's a safe bet Lang's even more dangerous now. I'll take whatever advantage I can get against these bastards. Their attempts may have had at least one unintended side effect. I received word from the Asari counselor. They're requesting an update on the Crucible. Lang has them scared. Enough to send help? Hmm. Yes, the Asari and Solarians are both throwing in their support now. How's Very your progress good. on the Crucible? Very good. good. Our estimates suggest we've completed nearly 50% of the known work. So quickly. Once decoded, the schematics are designed in such a way that allows our scientists to easily translate the information. It's not Prothean specific. Hmm. Are we any closer to understanding how to use it? That's still open for debate. Utilized in the right fashion, our scientists are convinced it can generate enough energy to destroy the Reapers. The question is, how will it dispense the energy? And in what form? You mean, how do you mm. stop it from wiping us all out? That's exactly. a very good question. We think the catalyst is the key to determining how to focus its energy, how to direct its energy at the Reapers alone. I'm working on that. You'll find the answer, Shepard. I'll send you an update on the schematics. 
And in the meantime, we'll keep building. And we'll keep fighting. Make sure there's an Earth left to come back to. You've always trusted me. I won't let you down. We're still in this. The gods of war haven't given up on us yet. Good luck, both of you. Anderson out. Commander, the Tyrian fleet is stretched thin. We need more support ships. And the Quarians are willing to talk. Understood, sir. I'll look into it. Hey, we can see Tally. We've got reports of instability along the Geth border. Hack it out. And Legion. That's another crucial part of this game. Shepard, do you have a moment? A contact within Asari High Command was insistent I pass on a distress signal to you. Something they can't handle? From what I can tell, they sent several commando squads to investigate. None of them returned. They didn't ask me directly, but I think High Command is hoping you might help. What's your take on this? That they wouldn't ask for help if it wasn't important. The colony's coordinates are on the galaxy map. I'll try to figure out what's going on. Okay. Now it's time to talk to people. See where everyone's at. It's normally how things go. So, be right back. Commander, I've got a lead on something interesting. Have you got a minute? Sure, talk to Commander, me. Commander, I've found something you need to see. Okay. What have you got? A group of Cerberus scientists cut ties and fled. Perhaps they finally realized they were nope. on the yep. wrong side. Found this one too. I don't too. know what they were researching, but they were among the elusive man's top scientists. They could help build the crucible. Maybe we could recruit them. Lots of Cerberus people think they're doing the right thing. I know I did. And you were right, Commander. Whatever crimes Cerberus is committing now, I was on Horizon when the Collectors attacked. Really? You'll recall I mentioned growing up in the Terminus systems. I was visiting my family at home. While the Alliance was running studies, you were saving me and my family. Has the Alliance tried to make contact with the scientists? They've been unable to find them, but they're searching. As is Cerberus. I've been monitoring Cerberus communications. I've charted signal frequency from various Cerberus cells by location and cross-referenced known ship movements. You found them? I She's so. quite smart. Yes. Nice work. Put it on the map and I'll give it a look. Thanks for your time, Commander. Anytime. This emails. A lot of missions open up with that. If you cannot find the E-Gel thermal coupling in the Citadel, like if you don't want to go to the shops and stuff, that's fine. Um, you can easily get it on the ship too. Let's talk to some more people up here. Trainer, if you're not doing anything, I've got a few hours free. Would you like to come up? Come on up. Your cabin is gorgeous. I've seen apartments smaller than this. Oh, an actual shower. The faucets in the women's bathroom are crap, by the way. Uh, remember that, I guess? In any event, <laughs> I thought you might be in the mood to play. Chess? I bought a board on the Citadel. Gooey interface, not nearly as much fun as real pieces. But I hope you might give me some pointers. Mm-hmm. How That's about fine. a shower? I figured you'd be more interested in a shower. I didn't realize that was an option. It's an option. Well, just give me a moment to grab my things. I almost completely forgot that I was romancing her. But here I go. Ah, uh, hot water and room to stretch. I could get lost in here. Mm. Oh, it's like a week's worth of stress is washing off. And the timing's perfect. I was hoping to look nice to somebody. Hot date lined up? Hopefully more than just that. I play for keeps. Sounds serious. That depends on whether she's interested. <coughs> She's interested. Oh. 
I'm fully in my clothes. Are you using me for my shower? I certainly hope so. Well, in that case, it's yours whenever you like. Mm. Well, got that romance done. It's still going, but I love it. Trainer, can you send Diana up? She wanted an interview. Right away, Commander. Very professional ready after all that. <laughs> I'm ready. Sorry. Commander, it's no secret that Council Space has suffered some serious losses to the Reapers lately. Now Cerberus has struck directly at the seat of our government. If something as small as a human terrorist organization can hit the Citadel, is anywhere safe? Cerberus has limited resources. This coup attempt was likely the best they could do, and it cost them a lot of money and troops. A little fear is understandable, but it can't paralyze you. They've failed as many times as they've succeeded. But humanity has lost its counselor. The Alliance Parliament is destroyed, and the Prime Minister's dead. The line of succession is getting pretty short. How long do you expect any new Alliance administration to last? Leaders will rise. You can't lose hope. Our enemies won't rest until they've taken the last human being. Until then, we're not beaten. Right now, it's everyone's duty to step up. All right. Now, a question from Thessia. All right. That Commander, good. during your tribunal, some said you had Cerberus ties. Thanks for your time, Shepard Commander. looks so Ms. annoyed Diana with that question. <laughs> good night and stay Sorry. strong. Be careful, Commander. You keep feeding me like this, and I'll follow you home. Gotta say no. I think we're just <laughs> fine in front of the camera. Oh, did you think? Uh, of course you did. Me and my big mouth. I'd better get out of here before I send another wrong signal. See ya, Commander. I don't know why that camera came right up into my face, but it did. Oh yeah, James wants to come up too. James, apparently. Some time if you want to talk privately. On my way. Hey man, how's it going? What's up? Hey James, you? Good, good. Wow. So this is what I can look forward to when I get my own command. A lot of fishes, a lot of models. You want your yes. own ship, Vega? <laughs> yeah, maybe Sorry. one day. When I'm old and I can't fight worth shit anymore. Excuse me? make fun of your commander. Sorry, Mom. I guess maybe I got some things on my mind. I, I wanted to get your opinion on something. Shoot. What did you do when they asked you to join the N7 program? I mean, was it a no-brainer for you, or did you think about it before accepting? The N7 program is a big deal, but it's also a big commitment. I hear that. You get the best training, best equipment, best assignments. And they expect the best in return. Yes, they do. Why are you asking? Well, even all the shit that's going on, somebody somewhere managed to track me down and forward an N7 commendation. It's dated the same day the Reapers attacked Earth. You don't sound too thrilled. Well, aside from the fact that there won't be an N7 program if we don't win this war, I just... Being a soldier is the only thing I've ever been really good at. And not because I try. I lot to kick my ass out years ago. Last time I had a command, I lost almost everyone. And they promoted me for it. I guess I'm just not sure if I'm ready to lead again. I don't know if I want that responsibility. You mentioned that before. What went wrong? What didn't go wrong? We were out on patrol, checking on some strange readings. Then the collectors hit. But they hit the colony first. By the time we got back, most of the colonists had been subdued or abducted, including our CO, Captain Tony. So you were in charge? Yeah. We laid low for a bit, waiting for a chance to strike. But before we could, we were betrayed. One of the colonists turned out to be a Cerberus spy working with the Collectors. I had no choice. I killed him and destroyed the Collector ship. But it got ugly. We lost most of the colonists and all but one of my squad. Not exactly a textbook operation. You can't blame yourself for being put in a tough situation. 
And if you were promoted, then something must have gone right. Sure, but... If you'd saved them all, would things have worked out better? I... I don't know. I don't think so. The right choice is usually not the easy one. Yeah. It's normally how the Did saying you know goes. Before you joined the N7? Yep. That's why I was asked. Nothing That's easy. Why they asked you. There is not a single N7 that hasn't sacrificed either themselves or their soldiers at some point. Yeah. So you think I should accept? I don't know what I'm trying to say there. Making a hard decision is hard for a reason. Making the easy decision doesn't always make it the right decision, is where I was kind of going with that. Assuming we survive this, that's a no-brainer. You're a damn good soldier, Vega. Don't waste that opportunity. I'll think about it. Seriously. If you don't mind, maybe don't mention this to anyone else. Of course not. Gracias. Well, I think I better get back to the hangar. Things here, it's a little too soft for me. The bed's a lot harder than it looks. Are you flirting with me, Lola? I'm going, I'm going. Thanks again, Shepard. Anytime. Just the deadpan look of... No, definitely not. Anyway. So I am going to go ahead and explore a lot of these, uh... A lot of the map. Stuff that I really suggest that you do. Yourself. Mostly because it's just long and boring so I'm not going to record it or show it in any way um, it's not that hard to find the items that you need to find on here and the only thing I'm really doing is doing the missions if that makes sense I hope so anyway so I will do that and I will be right back <laughs> 